A showdown in San Francisco between lawmakers concerned with public safety in the city's last remaining gun store reaches an end game. The store is closing under siege from new regulations from City Hall. John Blackstone shows us how gun supporters wonder if it was even a fair fight. The modest storefront in San Francisco's Mission District doesn't do justice to the iconic status of High Bridge Arms. As the last gun shop in San Francisco, it does as brisk a business in souvenir shirts as it does in firearms. We've gotten a call from someone in, uh, from Minnesota yesterday. We sent two off to uh, St. Cloud. <laughs> the shirts have been selling quickly since High Bridge announced it's shutting down. At the end of October, we'll be, uh, we'll be done. General Manager Stephen Al Cairo says the store is being pushed out of business by a proposed city law that would require every gun sale to be videotaped. When a customer takes delivery of their firearm, um, they want us to videotape that person doing that and then submit it to the police department. Gun buyers already have to fill out a detailed form, go through a background check and a waiting period. But sending a videotape of the purchase to local police strikes Al Cairo as one regulation too many. Well, the idea was just announced uh, that following two weeks, sales just dipped. It was like a ghost town here. Nobody was coming in. The legislation has been proposed by Mark Farrell, a member of the city's board of supervisors. If I have to choose between the existence of a gun store in San Francisco or the public safety of our residents, I'm going to choose the public safety of our residents every single day. Do you have any evidence that, that in fact they have been supplying guns to people who shouldn't have guns? None in this store in particular. And again, the target of this legislation is not one store in particular. But it's the only store in town. Right now it is, but we've also heard that other stores were looking uh, to move to San Francisco. And the residents of San Francisco are demanding that we do everything we can to make our streets safer. When Highbridge closes, gun buyers won't have to go far. There's a gun store just south of San Francisco's city limits. Will San Francisco be any safer when your door shuts permanently? I don't think so. Not at all. Not in the very least. What will be lost if this store closes? I think a piece of San Francisco's history. The gun racks are emptying fast at Highbridge. For those just looking for a shirt, the only ones left are extra large. For CBS This Morning, John Blackstone, San Francisco.